Hi everybody, welcome back to A Glittery Life. You guys, I hope that you are having a great week. I am on vacation, I'm having a blast. I'm sure with my friends and family, you can follow along what I'm doing on Instagram and hopefully you've had a chance to watch some of the videos this week, but I just have a really quick depotting video for you because as you know, at Fame Expo, I got the Dome Z palette to depot my MAC Mineralize Skin Finishes. So I just did a really quick how-to, super easy, really short video for you. You know what the funniest thing is though? In my mind, when I was buying this palette, it was full. In my mind, I had enough mineralized skin finishes to fill this entire palette. So then I got home and I was like looking for them. I could only find these two. I have a bunch of the other kind but that are really powdery and they're not the ones that are baked to these like terracotta stones. They're the extra dimension skin finishes. I have a bunch of those. You can't depot those by the way. You don't even try it. So in my, in my head, I thought, Oh my gosh, I'm, this is going to be so awesome. I'm going to have this whole dome Z palette full of mineralized skin finishes and it's going to be so cool and I'm going to travel with it and it's going to be like my new favorite thing. You guys, somehow I only have two. I don't, I, I don't know what's wrong with me. I don't know where the rest of them are. I don't know if I've ever bought any others and maybe I'm just crazy. Um, but literally, I was so disappointed with myself. I'm like, what kind of beauty blogger are you that you only have two MAC mineralized skin finishes? I texted my friend Kim, what up Kim J, who always watches and watches my videos and who's just like an awesome friend to me. I texted her a picture. She was like, where are the rest of them? And I was like, I've never been so disappointed with, my, with myself. And then I texted like, hangs head in shame. I'm like, what in the world? So anyway, you guys, if you use the mineralized skin finishes, you gotta leave me a comment down below telling me which ones I need to pick up because this is pathetic, real pathetic, real pathetic real pathetic. So anyway, you guys, if you want to know how to depot yours um, and put them in a Z palette, if you have a large collection of them, I, I got to tell you, this is going to be the way to go. I just never reach for mine. I've got way too much other stuff in that drawer and I never reach for them. So this is going to be a great way for me to start using them. So anyway, leave me a comment down below which ones I'm missing, which ones your favorites and what I need. So you guys, thanks so much for watching. And if you like depotting videos and you like seeing what, if you want to see what else is in my Z palette collection, thumbs up this video. Okay. So I've got my domed Z palette brand new, just picked it up at Fame Expo. So that's the first thing that you need. The second th thing that you need is a flat iron. I'm using this new one from ISO. Uh, this will be my first time using it. Then you need a MAC Skin Finish, or I'm also going to try to depot my, this might be crazy, but I'm going to try to, I'm going to depot my Extra Dimension uh, Skin Finishes. And then I'm going to just try to use my little palette mixing knife to pop those out once we need to. And then the Z palette comes with the little magnet backings to put on them. Okay, so I'm going to depot the MAC Mineralized Skin Finished, and this is the uh, shade Refined. This is so easy to do, you guys, in case you're ever wondering about this. You just pop this lid open, and then you're gonna put it on your flat iron, and you're gonna just let it heat the glue up, because that's actually baked in there. Now, I do have my flat iron turned up pretty high, so it is nice and hot. So let's see if we have got that on there long enough. And you want to just really gently pry this out. You do not want to like work at that too hard because you do not want to uh, break that at all. So we have that guy out and what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a couple of these metal Z palette things to really try to cover some of that glue because it's kind of a mess. And now I want to go ahead and get this sticker off. I want to be able to put the sticker on the bottom of these um, MSFs. So I'm going to go ahead and see if I can't get that sticker to come off by just putting that back on the heat for another minute. 
So let's see if that's warm enough to like come up. Mm, it looks like that needs a little bit more heat on it. So now you can see that's coming up nice and easy. That's perfect. And I'm gonna go ahead and take Refine, the sticker, and I'm just gonna pop it right on this back side. So that way it helps me stay organized and then I can tell you to, you know, what I'm using if I'm using these, or I'm sure you'll see these now in favorites videos because I'll actually be using them. So since I've only depotted these two, obviously uh, it seems that I need some more Mac mineralized skin finishes to fill up this palette since I'm not going to be able to depot any of the extra dimensions to go in with this which is kind of what my plan was so I hope that was helpful go ahead and thumbs up this video if you like the depotting videos and if you're going to go ahead and give it a try to depot some of yours